Okay, Teddy, nice to meet you, mate. How you doing? Legend, yeah, very well, how are you? Good, good. Good, good. So the first question I have is, uh, everyone always said about you that the first two yards were in your head. Were they? Um, <laughs> what what yeah. does that mean? I, what does that mean? That means that uh, I was very slow as a footballer, <laughs> as, as a runner, and I had to think about things to try and uh, lose defenders. So I suppose that's where the where the two yards was was always in my head first. Did, did you like? Were you aware of that as a player? When people started saying that about you, were you aware that that was something that you were always slightly ahead of the game in terms of the way that you read it compared to other players? I was always aware of the fact that uh, people said that I was too slow to get to the next level. You know, even from like my younger days, from Millwall to getting in mm. youth team to the reserves, to the first team, and then going on to the next level at that. So, you know, that that was always. That was always labelled at me, and then when I succeeded at the next level, it was like, well, you know, the first two yards must be in his head. That's what it's all about. Yeah, and a lot of people compare players to you now. Harry Kane, of course, is one of those. Is Harry Kane the next Teddy Sheringham? Uh, not really. I, I would say there's um, he has certain aspects that he does, but he, he does things that I could never ever dream of doing. Hmm. The way he plays the game, he, I would say. If you had a mix of myself and, and Jurgen Klinsmann, I think he has that he has that uh, dynamic side to him that Jurgen had, and yeah. you know when he gets a half a chance, he, he buries it like like Jurgen used to as well. So yeah. uh, quite a fantastic prospect, and uh, let's hope he does well again this year. And second season syndrome, do you see that happening, or do you think he's gonna? Not he's the type of player to he's he's got too much class and. Ability. I think so. I think so. Um, I think he's a top player in the making. I don't think he's quite as a top player yet, but he's he's still a young lad and, mm. and he's determined to progress and he has the right attitude to 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 get where he wants to go. And as long as he gets a little bit of help from uh, the Tottenham Tottenham staff and Tottenham players around him, then uh, I think he'll go far. And you mentioned Jurgen Klinsmann. Klinsmann famously said that you were the most intelligent strike partner that he ever had. So was the feeling mutual? Is he the best strike partner you had or who did you enjoy playing alongside most yeah at, at club level uh, Jurgen was was definitely the the best best partner I ever had uh, I have to say at England level with, with Alan Shearer he, yeah. he was topped as well yes I guess and to try and pick one of those two like the better one out of the two would be very harsh you know that they're, yeah. they're both top top players yeah and another thing I've always, always wanted to ask you, that corner, that, that, that corner, the Teddy Sheringham corner that we all try now, I, you know, me and my mates try it at five a side. Whose idea was that? How did you come um, up with it? That was my idea. I, I just said to Darren Anderton um, a couple of times, like, like just, just play it to me and I'll, and I'll try and lose this man on the edge of the box and don't, don't smash it too hard, just put it to my right foot and yeah. hopefully I'll, the timing will be perfect and, and we'll get a chance out of it and Brilliant. It, whenever I asked Darren to do anything like to put it exactly where I wanted it mm. he put it there that's, that's what made him such a great player yeah brilliant well let's tell you you're an absolute Spurs legend put it there mate thank Thanks you very very much, very much. and this is Spurred on TV both jobs are on offer Spurs and United jobs same time both offer to you which one do you take um, 